Problems of an economy The students will be able to diagnose and understand the various problems faced by an economy. It has been rightly said that the first lesson of economics is scarcity. There is never enough of anything to fully satisfy all those who want it. Be it a rich nation or poor, rich person or poor, all face the problem of scarcity or not having enough. The problem of scarcity is faced by everyone, regardless of a person or country being rich or poor. Human wants are unlimited. Resources are limited but have alternative uses. That is why every economy has to face the problem of making choice. This in turn gives rise to various economic problems like what to produce, how to produce, for whom to produce. The problem of what to produce gives rise to a basic question. What kind of goods should be produced? Consumer goods or capital goods? Consumer goods are produced in less developed economies with high density of population. Capital goods are produced in the developed economies where technological revolution has already set in. Next problem arises is how to produce. It is mainly the problem of choice of the techniques of production. These techniques are labor-intensive technique, which makes more use of labor than capital. Less developed countries with abundant labor opt for this technique. Capital-intensive technique makes more use of capital than the labor-intensive technique. The developed countries with abundant capital reserves opt for this technique. Finally, the problem faced by an economy is to decide for whom to produce. National output is distributed among the various factors of production in terms of the factor incomes. If income is unequally distributed, then there will be more poor or middle class people than the rich. Suppose an economy chooses to produce consumer goods. It has to decide whether it will produce more of necessaries or comforts. And luxuries. If income distribution is unequal, the economy will produce more of the necessaries than the luxury goods. Let us have a quick glance at the various economic problems we learned. What to produce? How to produce? For whom to produce? 